Okay, it's uh, Wednesday afternoon, end of day. I hope this is working properly. Seems to be. Um, and uh, just take, take a look at uh, what's actually happened uh, over the course of the day. Uh, I would say that we're probably 99% there. Uh, you'll see that the soffits and fascia are finished here. The siding is finished here. The siding is mostly finished here. Going up this wall. There's one strip right there that is not complete. There is one strip right there that is not complete. The entire wall is complete at this point. Capping is on garage. So there's this little cap that's been placed on the ledge on this side and on the ledge on this side. Still a piece of strapping here on this end for some reason or other. And a stray piece of scaffolding is there. Scaffolding is still in place. Inside, a fair amount of work has been done as well. So above the sliding door, you can see that the trim has been placed there. Uh, the reason that it's so wide compared to the trim around all of the other windows and doors is that there is quite a space of um, insulation that needs to be uh, covered up. So we'll need to do some real paint job there. And the four windows up top are now trimmed out as well. Trim and the spacers and uh, foam has been put in there as well. So that's all ready to go. So the things that we are not seeing complete yet, the shiplap that needs to be in behind here on this wall. The um, covers for the HVAC, so there's one there, and there's one there, and there's one in each of the bedrooms, and there's one there, and there's one there, and there are also additional pieces that need to go downstairs. Um, those are not complete yet. Okay, moving outside. I'll uh, take you around the house and show you the mostly complete uh, project. Um, there's a piece of capping that's missing there. The garage doors obviously are not finished, nor is the interior of the garage finished either. Um, so we need to have, um, we were originally, we we're going to be using metal on the inside of the garage. I haven't seen hide nor hair of that. This wall, except for that small little strip that you saw seen already, is complete right up to the fascia and the uh, soffits. And coming around to the front side, this has been complete now for a while already. Let me just walk down here, turn around, and the entire front side is now complete. So you can see it from the front door section all the way up. Soffits and fascia. To the other corner. And the skirting is at the bottom. 
that's complete. Oh, skirting is not complete yet here. All the way up. Soffits and fascia are finished. And there's the vent for our um, HVAC system. It looks like it needs to be placed yet a little bit. Um, and the conductor for the electricity needs to be remounted on the wall somewhere here. That's interesting. So that'll have to be painted as well. Uh, I think you can see it. There's a white channel on the inside that will need to be painted just in the same way that the channels up there will need to be painted as well. I wonder what the, uh, now that I see them, there's a whole bunch of yellow jackets up there. wonder where they're going or if they've been displaced. So this wall is complete, including the soffits and fascia. The skirt is not complete yet though. That is not in place. You can see here. And the skirt over there is not complete either. But that one piece of the brown is now in place at the bottom. And moving around to the back. This wall, as it has been for uh, the last week or so, is complete. But now let's look above where those four windows were and see the extent to which they are complete as well. And so, as you can see, soffits, fascia, siding, cut around the windows, all in place, it is complete. So it looks like it is a finished house. Wonder of wonders of wonders. And the skirting is in place all the way along. So I'll just go to the last section, the last wall, which has not changed significantly in the last couple of weeks. So here we've got the garage wall, and it's complete now as well, except not sure what has to happen right at the end edge of the garage there because that's where the majority of the water is actually going to come off so I assume there's going to be some kind of uh, uh, an eaves trough or something along those lines that will need to be placed in there yet but for all intents and purposes Siding, soffits, and fascia. I think I'm going to uh, get a final shot of the house. Uh, maybe I'll go over into Kathy's yard, it's her next door neighbor, and uh, see what kind of a shot I can set up. <laughs>